have got to expose our people to digital resource and expose them to the ability to use digital resource and turn it around to be able to teach it in the classroom to kids. Um, when students come to us these days, they, they are technologically literate, but not necessarily technologically learning literate. And so we've got to be able to guide that, and, and this is a big part of that. With everything that we have to do, it's really a busy job, and so sometimes it feels like professional learning is the last thing that we get to fit in. The Leadership in Blended and Digital Learning program allows principals to come together for professional learning, which is really important because they often don't have this opportunity. The program spans across the course of a year and brings principals together in a community so that they are able to learn from their peers as well as experts who bring new information that they can then go back and apply in their schools. We wanted a way for principals to have some professional development for their schools in order to implement a digital and blended learning environment for their teachers. This is something that comes from the digital teaching and learning program that's being implemented in the state and we really felt that principals needed professional development targeted to them to go along with that digital teaching and learning and this is one way we felt it would make a huge impact in the schools. In the past six months, we've been involved in LBDL, and it's, I've already seen a change in our teachers and our students and in the teaching and learning that's happening here at West Valley. We've had um, a change in the mindset of our teachers already. We chose the SAMR model to kind of focus on as a faculty to where we want to try and get the um, students using the technology in meaningful and purposeful ways. You know, professional development is something that we get online sometimes, so a webinar, but and especially considering the remote location of our school where we're in Monument Valley, really far away from where professional development is offered, it's not very often. So this has been a unique experience to be able to have it right here at our district. The district office is 70 miles away from even our school, so to have the opportunity to be able to go to PD that's close by for us, um, especially for me as administrator, has been really powerful. Every time we have a session, I come back with all these ideas of different ways to integrate that in with our instruction that aren't a, a huge, big change, but are just minor tweaks and changes based upon what we're doing. We just consider technology a real critical component of a child's learning, and so it's paramount that our building leaders have that training and be able to facilitate uh, training with their teachers, uh, to have guidance, uh, to have experience with digital learning. We've had outstanding participation by our principals. They've really bought into it and our building leaders uh, as well as our teachers. Um, our trainers have been outstanding with the help of UEN uh, and the things that they've provided. We've had real great adoption. Uh, we've had uh, people own the training, own their uh, learning and their knowledge and so we're seeing a real positive uh, impact in the classroom in that we have building leaders that can uh, talk uh, authoritatively and experientially about digital and blended learning. To learn more, visit uen.org slash leadership.